I'm here at the community gate for 1109 Tuscan Sky, and adjacent to the gate is the unit. It's actually this two-car garage with a front door entrance over on the side of the house. It is a townhome, so you do have attached neighbors. Uh, what I like about this is that you right, are right across the street from the pool. So that's super easy to get to, and the community will take care of that for you. So here's the garage. Uh, typically you'd go through that door, but I want to show you the front door. So you do have a side gate to get to your backyard. Okay, here at the front door, here's the living room. It feels a little tight, but I think some of it has to do with the fact that they have this decorative pony wall. Again, two-car garage. So you have a really cute covered patio, a backyard that's pretty low maintenance. You've got a couple cactus, but um, I mean, if it's a problem for the dog, you can always yank it out. But I think the dogs know to kind of stay away from the pokey things. And then again, you've got your side yard where you can drag in your garbage cans. One air conditioning unit. So the backyard did um, back up to a road, but it's not a very heavily traveled road. It's um, pretty peaceful, actually. Um, you do have stairs and then a full bathroom downstairs. Linen closet. And then you have this hallway closet as well. It's pretty deep. And then you have the downstairs bedroom. And this is probably 11 by 12 or maybe 12 by 12. Fan and uh, ceiling, ceiling fan and plantation shutters. Oh, and then you do have um, kind of a standard two door closet. We'll go upstairs. So coming up the stairs, this is pretty impressive. You have this cathedral ceiling. So it's really, whew, it's high. Um, I was like, oh. you have a, a, a smoke detector up there. Good God, you're gonna have to hire someone with a tall ladder. Um, but there's one bedroom, here's another, and then the laundry room behind me. Okay, so let's do an overview of this again. I turn on the lights now. Um, but you have the laundry room, two bedrooms up here. This is your hot water heater. You have another linen closet. Can't get over these ceilings up here, it's so tall. So this is the master. And you've got a nice built out uh, master closet, really good size. You have the um, like tubing so you can put your TV up there and all the wires drop down and you pull them out at the bottom. Plantation shutters on all the windows. Little toilet room. I really like this layout. And there's a lot of um, can lights that I haven't turned on in this room yet. I haven't, couldn't find the light switch. Oh, wait, here we go. Maybe we can... Oh, oh. I'll figure it out. Um, okay, so this is bedroom three. What's nice about this is it actually has its own bathroom. So this is super cute too. And this is probably 12 by 13 or 14 feet. It's a little wider, and then you've got a little walk-in closet. So again, this is the room. So the pool's closed for the winter, but I thought I'd give you an idea of what this looks like.
And again, the house is right there. So super close to the pool, which is awesome. And then you can maybe hear the freeway noise, but the freeway's right there. That's the 515 freeway.